Today on Blog Success Journal, we're talking about how to start a blog step four, okay? Making a great first impression with your blog by having a great theme. You know the basic template's fine, but you really want to add your personal style to it. And all a theme is, is it's a template for your website. It's just kind of like a wrapper. And you don't need a custom theme, okay? There's tons of free ones out there. Yeah, think website design. It's a plug and play website design. And that's one of the, another one of the reasons we like WordPress. That's simple. Okay, here's the thing with custom themes. We love custom themes later, okay? You don't make your own clothes, you don't design your own clothes, except for a minor, you know, small fraction of you guys out there who can do that. But the rest of us, we go to the store and we pick clothes and buy them. And, and it's no different for your WordPress design. Don't get a custom theme until you can afford it because they can be expensive. So how do you do it? How do you find free themes? You can Google it. That's one option, but you don't even need to do that. Log into your WordPress dashboard, and over on the left-hand side, there's a little thing called, a tab that says Appearance. Click on that, click on Themes, and there's tons of free themes for you to choose from. Yeah, WordPress will just download it from the WordPress site, and just and you can just install it right there, and you activate it, and it's, it's I mean, it's really that simple. Now, the theme of the day, theme. The, the theme, theme of, of the day. day is starting, getting started. That's where mm -hmm. most people get stuck, and they never get started. Oh, I want it to look perfect. You know what? You don't start with perfect. You start with whatever you got, and then mm -hmm. you get better. Progress that's over perfection. That's progress, and that's how you get successful. Yep. That's one of the big secrets to success right there. Okay, so premium theme. So first you first you start with a, with a simple free theme that you download into WordPress, you get it up and running, and you're good to go, okay? You start. now. Then you can move up to what they call premium themes, which are not free. These are, uh, it's, it's, it's kind of like uh, in between free a little and nicer clothes. You pay yeah. a little bit more, right? <laughs> so the, Stop shopping at Walmart, start shopping in Nordstrom. We're, we're kind talking, of thing. Uh, say, $50 up to hundreds of dollars, but you can get some really decent premium themes for under $100, okay? Mm -hmm. So it's after you're already making a little money, you're already getting some traffic, right? We particularly like those from Studio Press. They have some really good themes. And you can customize those some also, but again, don't get too hung up on that. You know, later on, we can talk about your own custom themes. Right, so how do you install these themes that you find? Well, if you're in WordPress on the free themes, it's so easy. You click on appearance, go to the theme, and there's a little button that says activate. You can activate it and go look, huh, do I like that one? No, go click on another one, activate it, huh, do I like that one? I mean, it's really that simple. And you know, we like simple, we like easy. Remember, simple the theme good. of the day is getting started and making something happen, right? Not getting stuck, oh, it's gotta be perfect. So okay. on that note. Very important. So on that note, we have a question for you. What's your favorite free WordPress theme? You gotta have one. Which one do you like? Leave a comment and let us know.